Use the excavation and fills tool for modeling the terrain. Click on the points to define the excavation or elevation limits. I'll click for inserting new points and double click to confirm. Set the terrain movement parameters referring to the first clicked point. Select some points. Tracing a selection rectangle. Move interactively the points up or down, tracing the mouse on the window. The first terrain surface was changed, while the second is unchanged. Click on the S1 and S2 buttons to see the first and second surfaces. Enable both S1 and S2 surfaces to see the differences and to calculate cut and fill volumes. Get the calculator from the left palette and define the calculation area clicking on the model points. Double click to end. Press the calculator buttons to see calculation results. Choose Show Data from the Data menu to see a complete report of the volume calculation. For every model triangle, the fill and cut volume are reported. Choose the Section tool from the left palette and draw a section polygon clicking on the model points. Press Alt click for getting points everywhere and double click at the end. Choose section from the calculations menu to open the section window. Choose section parameters from the data menu for setting the most appropriated parameters. Enable the S1 or S2 button on the right palette to display the modified or unmodified terrain surfaces. Enable both to display the differences. Thank you for your attention.